Why, hello. Well, it is very true that I, Caroline, am releasing a song called Simple This Tuesday Night because it's about ready for a song. And you've heard all the songs before. You've heard the story going from on and off to We Should Break Up. And I think it's ready to give you the next part. And the song will be everywhere. It'll be on um, Spotify, Apple Music, TikTok, Deezer, YouTube, everywhere. And it's going to be really exciting. That's so soon. Yes, it is, because I don't want to keep you waiting. And I'm going to give you a little bit more information. I can't give you too much information. Shout out to you, Evie. Thank you so much. You're so sweet, and I'm happy that you're excited for the new song. I just want to let you know that there's a reason why I have this stuff on. There's a reason. I can't give too much information today because I'm going to give more information, give some information today, some tomorrow, some Tuesday, then Tuesday night it comes out. But I'm going to try to give you as much information as possible, and I'm really excited about it. <laughs> um, okay. So there is a pre-save giveaway, which is really cool. So you can go to the link in my bio, pre-save the song either on Apple Music or Spotify. And once you pre-save it, um, okay, so you hit the button, it says pre-save, and then there's a little check mark. You can do a screenshot, DM it to me, and then you will be entered to listen to Simple before it comes out. Because yes, this song is called Simple. Do you get it now? Because I don't know if you know this, but for months, whenever somebody asked me about a new song, they said, what's the new song gonna be like? I said, it's Simple. Remember that I said that, Simple. And the song's called Simple. That's huge goggles. There's a reason I'm wearing them because you know I always have a theme for my songs. I have to have a theme for my songs. But I don't want to give the theme away, but you're probably going to know what it is by the end. Of course, Evie underscore MXE. You're so sweet. Um, so hopefully the song has a powerful message that you enjoy. It's a very distinctive thing that happened in my life, and it really gives you some more context into the story of what I'm talking about in all my songs and why it's not that simple. But it's called simple. <laughs> um, and it really does, I love um, sharing this with you because it really is a chapter in my life. And that's beautiful goggles. Thank you, aren't they huge? They're huge. They're, it's like my whole face. Imagine if I tried to go out in public and wear my mask and wear this, like you wouldn't see me. I wouldn't even, it's crazy. Um, but yeah, and I think in some ways it all has to do with mental health, which I know that might sound weird, but because obviously I'm talking about a toxic relationship, and the thing is toxic relationships do have to do with mental health because they can ruin your mental health and in so many ways and sometimes insecurity can play into that as to why you don't want to leave and there's a lot of things. I don't want to give too much away but I'm very very passionate about the song. It's also a very emotional song but I can't wait for you to hear but let's let the countdown begin. Two and a half days Tuesday night. I'm going to do a countdown on my story. So that's going to be really fun. Happy Sunday to you too Shadachin. 9471. Thank you for being so sweet. And this is an extremely personal song. So I really, I hope you like it. And I'm just, I'm so excited about it. It's honestly, I've never been so excited to release a song than I have for this one because I really, really love this song. It's like my favorite. Um, obviously, everybody has their opinion. So it might not be your favorite, but it is my favorite out of all the songs I've done, so I'm really excited. But now, I wanna do something really fun, because you know I like to be cryptic, you know I like to give hints, and okay. So I'm gonna tell you 10 things, sorry, I need some paper to read it, sorry. I'm gonna tell you 10 things that you may not know about me, 10 random facts about me. However, every single fact that you hear about this song actually has to do 
with this sorry every fact that you hear about me actually has to do with the song and is a hint into the lyrics of the song what the song will sound like the theme of the song and what it will be like okay are you ready number one i like things simple and i really do like things simple i'm a little bit of a minimalist like even which may be surprising because i do like glitter but i also like things very very simple you know what i mean if I could have a superpower, I would like to read people's minds because I just feel like it'd be really nice to know what people are thinking all the time. Thank you, Kirstia199. I'm happy you like the glasses. Nice shades. Thank you, Noah. That's very nice of you. Happy almost birthday, July 26. It's your birthday. Really cool. Um, so I'd like to read people's minds. I feel like reading people's minds would make life a lot easier and make people make it a lot better. Open communication, you'd get to know what people think and you'd also get to know what their true intentions are. So I feel like reading people's minds would be really nice. My favorite movie as a child was Mission Impossible. Yes, that does have to do with Simple, the song. Um, I think people should talk more about toxic relationships and how to get out of them. And the reason why I say that is because there's so many relationships that are toxic, but a lot of us don't necessarily know the signs of is a relationship healthy or is it toxic? Because all relationships have their ups and downs and have their issues, so sometimes it's hard to tell the difference. I'm sorry, I'm trying to talk about something serious and I doubt any of you can take me seriously wearing any of these glasses. But, you know, it's for the song. It's for the song. I have to. Um, so, number five is I love musicals. I do. I love musicals. I think musical theater is really fun. It tells a story. I mean, you know, the whole thing that I like to do with pop music is I like to tell a story through songs. That's basically what a Broadway musical is. You're telling... Although I would like less talking in the mu in the musicals and more songs, but that's just me. But I do love musicals, and that does have to do with Simple, too. So, I'm sorry, I'm too excited to talk about this. I'm so weird, I'm sorry. Um, number six is I like to listen. I'm more of a listener. Like, I know that might seem weird because I come on here every single day and I talk, like, forever. And <laughs> but I'm actually much more of a listener. I really like... To listen to people's problems and I don't like to talk about my own problems and I'd rather like listen than talk I'm just I'm a listener I like to listen number seven is sometimes I wish I was invisible I think sometimes we all wish we were invisible sometimes you just want to zap out and disappear and be invisible Number eight is I have really weak hands. It's why I'm so bad at the piano. It's why I can only play chords and they shake and I have carpal tunnel and they shake. Like sometimes I'll be holding this or eating and my hand shakes. My hands always shake. So yeah, that and that does have to do with simple, weirdly. Um, number nine is I've lived through many earthquakes. I live in an area where there are lots of earthquakes and I definitely know what an earthquake feels like for sure. One time I was in a car, like waiting for somebody to come in the car and there was just an earthquake and I thought the car was moving. It was an earthquake. One time I was in a chair and things were shaking and it was an earthquake and I was really nervous and I was so nervous that I got like all the mirrors out of my room because I was just really nervous because I felt like it was going to fall down. I can't sleep with anything over my head because I feel like there's going to be an earthquake in the middle of the night and it's going to fall on me because I've lived through several earthquakes. We both got shades. Oh my gosh, you changed your profile picture to a picture of you in shades? Oh my gosh, yes, we are living for it. Shades for life. Okay, number 10. The last fact that you may not know about me that has to do and hints at the song Simple coming out on Tuesday night is that I really value freedom. I think freedom is one of the most valuable things you can have. It's why I've always been very passionate about criminal justice. 
I just think freedom is a really important thing. And I think in a toxic relationship, it's really hard to be free. And I think freedom is something we all want. And it's something that I value. Okay, so those are the 10 facts. I'm so excited to share this with you. I hope that you enjoy the song. Sorry you have to wait two and a half days, but luckily it's only two and a half days. It's not like a week or two weeks, and it's gonna be a really fun release, and um, I have a lot more coming in the next two days, a lot more hints at the song, a lot more hints into what the theme is, and just a lot of stuff, so definitely keep in tune. Please pre-save the song in my link in bio and send it to me if you wanna listen to the song early early earlier before it's released and i just i really can't wait for this song to come out it's truly my favorite song ever it's like really different it's really different but it's also just my vibe and i just love it and it's very me the lyrics are very me it's extremely personal and i love it and thank you so much and i hope you love it remember tuesday night new song coming out it's gonna be awesome i'm really excited love you so much bye